got great doo wop tune coming up for you. Uh, of all the names to call a doo wop group, the Hippies with Memory Lane off of Billboard's Hot 100, April the 13th, 1963. Billboard's Hot 100 debuting at number 90. We'll get as high as number 63, though, on, on Billboard's Hot 100. The term the Hippies, not not that unusual back in 1963. Uh, of course, it came in fogue late in the 60s, but in 1963, you might remember South Street by the Orleans where they mentioned, where do all the hippies meet? South Street, South Street. And uh, that, uh, by the way, that song was at number three that very same week on April 13th, 1963. Uh, the memories, well, actually, uh, the hippies under, uh, well, they operated under a bunch of names. First off, they released uh, they re this song, uh, Memory Lane, was originally released in 1959 under the Stereos. Th this was off the Mink label. Then it was re-released on the Mink label under the name The Tams in 1959. Didn't do anything. But then a much bigger record company came into play. We're talking about the legendary Cameo Parkway label. The label of D.D. Sharp and Chubby Checker, uh, Bobby Rydell. And uh, they released Memory Lane under the moniker The Tams in 1963. Didn't do anything. Then they re-released the record. And later in night, well, in 1963, uh, under the name The Hippies, and it was more successful this time. Very successful in the Philadelphia area. That was the home of American Bandstand back in 1963, back in late, uh, late 50s, early 60s. Well, here it is. This is The Hippies at number debuting at, <laughs> I love it, debuting at number 90, classic doo wop. This is Memory Lane. 